SpongeBob SquarePants. What's up, y'all? It's me, LSP, and today we're at Wendy's trying the SpongeBob Krabby Patty meal. So for a little less than $11, you get the SpongeBob Krabby Patty, a regular fry, and a pineapple frosty. It's just a regular Wendy's burger with Krabby sauce. Are you ready? Lego. That just tastes like a Wendy's burger to me, so I took everything off, and we're just gonna try the Krabby Patty sauce by itself with the cheese. I don't know, maybe I should have asked for extra Krabby sauce? Let's see. Okay. Not bad, not bad at all. A mayo-based sauce, not as tangy as, say, a Big Mac sauce. There's not a real tang to it. It's pretty good. Now this, I've never seen a Frosty look like this, Wendy's. Why, why is my, why is it at the bottom? I guess I'm supposed to stir it up. I'm disappointed. Why am I having to work? Hmm, I'm definitely getting the pineapple taste, but you know, no Frosty is worth its salt. Unless it can pass the fry test. On the LSP scale 1 to 10, I would rate this entire meal 7.5 to an 8. It's not bad. So if I ever get this burger again, I will get it plain with cheese and Krabby Patty sauce. Because the sauce is good. And as far as the frosty, it's yummy. But I think they were supposed to mix it for me. I don't think I was supposed to do all that mixing. But it has a very pleasant pineapple taste. This meal is LSP approved. That's it. I'm done. Take care of yourselves. As always, no fear and no regrets. You're awesome. Peace. Quiet.